Hey, Billy! Hey, Tommy! Glad you could make it. Hey, you ever met Love Fist before? No, I haven't, but I've always loved your music. Let me introduce you to the band. This is Per Percy, Dick, and Willie's in the Kazi, and that was Jez in the booth earlier. And guys, I want you to meet a good friend of mine. This is Tommy. We go way back. Hey, pal. And, uh, what was your name again? Hey, <laughs> Jez, you remember. Lovefest. Don't be Did playing them games with me, Jesus. mate. I'm too crafty for that sunshine. English prick. Like good See, one in America. Look, the thing totally is, Tom, mental. the boys totally need some help. Totally they ain't too connected here. They don't have your ass, your father. We need some drugs, pal! Gotta get on the old <laughs> love yeah, fest, yeah, nice fury, you know? Yeah. Well, this is Vice City, man. What's the problem? Love juice, man. We need love juice, man, can? Love juice? Aye, two parts boomshine, one part trumpet, five fizz bombs, and a litre of petrol. Can you help us out, pal? Oh, we really mean a lot you to the boys. You can do that for the boys, right? Always upgraded, that's my motto. Well, mistress, uh, and a seat on the board, would you run around graffiti and your name all over town and making a nuisance of yourself, spinning on your back and popping and locking and... <laughs> Not a hope. It's simple. If you don't have a job, starve. Get out of my constituency, by force if necessary, and starve. That is quite simple. Are you really saying that? Of course I am. Looking for something special? I city. got what you need. Thanks for the money, games, sucker. But what I tell people is this. Gather up your life savings. Buy yourself a piece of swamp. Drain it and get rid of the damn wildlife. Then apply for planning permission. Pretty soon you can have your own retirement community or resort destination holiday place. You can start making money out of the boom. The shrub-inspired boom. And enjoy the kind of things sensible people have. Personal bodyguards, massive fences, and a bigger collection of guns than the other guy. It stands to reason. No, no, no! Hey, mate. The guys could do with some company, if you know what I mean. I know just the girl. Freedom River. And what about the other crimes? It seems scar crime, fashion crime, drugs, everything is on the rise. Absolutely. Of course it is. When I was in Uganda, people were poor, but they were happy. The more you have, the less you have. And that's kind of what I'm all about. There's satisfaction in spending all day weaving a basket, rather than just buying one at the store. At one point in Uganda, I saw a great lake of sand and a massive speaking dog. It was a dog of love, not of hate. It was a spirit journey. What are you talking about? I'm talking about hopes, dreams, the magic of television, especially public television. Puppets can say what men cannot. Yes, but how will that stop people taking baseball bats and pounding the living crap out of each other as I saw in a mother's PTA group meeting recently? Baseball is our national sport, our national pastime. Joining together as men in order to reward the act of running around in a circle. I will thank you not to take its name in vain, Chavez. I hate that spring training. Who do those guys think they are? Coming here and getting in the way, showing us no respect. Drinking our orange juice and seducing our women folk. Train in your own home, mister. Oh, hey, Mercedes. Hiya, Tommy. And how big. are you? Just fine. Listen, you fancy big having love fest? Which will flood okay. into a river of freedom. But just as a so favor, I expect return. Almost free. Almost. When we are floating away in the Caribbean Sea, free to run things our way, singing Kumbaya in the sunshine, no school, no tax, free barbecue and pinball for everyone. Sophisticated entertainment. Yes, well, what about the little guy? What about the guy who is standing there saying, I like being part of America. I like it a lot. I get public radio. I can hear Maurice Chavez. I own a small one-bedroom home. A business selling flowers to people stuck in traffic. Three or four radios all turned on to BCPR. A dog. Fifteen ice cubes. But I don't feel safe. I'm worried about gangs. Gangs are a myth put out by the liberal elite to patronize and demean the working man. I mean, what kind of right-minded youth from a poorer background is going to spend his time stealing things and posing in silly clothes when he could be getting ahead with a minimum wage job and making his parent proud? The dream of America is to live in a duplex I'll see you later, and big boy. Why would anyone want to threaten that great future? Answer me that and I'll show you a green dog. And sp
Guns are a way to be noticed in the boxy suburbs. You scream out, rather than urinate at the edge of your... Yes, but what about the guy getting beaten up on the street? Or the man having his motorcycle stolen? What about him? Or her? Some of the best bikers are really women. Anyone can join our group. This is about poor people getting together. But your father owns half of...